Hey everybody, it is I, Super Paul Games, and welcome back to Star Wars Rebellion. If you haven't seen the last episode, probably go watch it, because a lot happened. I'm going to get into it right now, so if you've not watched it, I didn't want to ruin it to you ahead, to you ahead of time. Good at words, am I? Bunch of units have arrived at Coruscant. Last time we took Coruscant! We have captured the Emperor. We have some people there to keep him prison. I wonder if I should put a guy there. Leave a guy on the planet. We're going to make a uh, solo... Well, we'll deal with those people in a moment. Paige, what about you? I'm kind of tempted to leave Chewie behind. I have mixed feelings about that, because if we look now, Chewie has a force ranking of trainee. The reason you might want to leave him behind is if Vader tried to show up to Coruscant, there's a chance Chewie would recognize him. But we're going to leave Paige, I think, behind. Uh, can we build any can troops there? You? Oh, we can. We're going to build a bunch of Celestrian regiments. Uh, we're going to transfer a bunch of these dweebs. Actually, we're going to send these to the fleet. The big thing we're waiting on now is to get some... Where are they? They should be at the bottom. These gravity well cruisers, the reason we want these is if we get engaged in a battle with an, an enemy fleet, the enemy fleet cannot go into hyperspace until they destroy these frigates. So we have a chance to destroy this good-sized fleet here off of Balmora. To my knowledge, the Empire only controls two planets anymore, Marist and Balmora. They probably control some stuff here in the Outer Rim that we don't know about, but I don't know about that. <laughs> Alright, we want to get one more guy here. Marist has become more and more Imperial. They totally love the Empire. I don't know if that's because we're blockading them, or very possibly Vader and some other Imperial operatives have been doing diplomacy there. Uh, Obraska. I thought you were building the troops there. Alright, where's this last troop? You go to Delea. So we have room for one. We have that built from Obraska. They should be able to build it very quickly. They'll build a Celestian Regiment that'll take two days. Take seven days to get there. Um, take a look at our fleets out there. I'm looking for the little blue ion engines to show that they're in transit, that, that they're not actually there. Because we had so many mis uh, messages last time, I just wanted to make sure we didn't miss any, which was very possible. Yeah, mines got deployed or something. Mine deployed at Alalixia. Where? Oh, down here. So that's one of the places in Sumitra. You can see we've conquered like four of these areas. Conquer isn't probably the right word. More we have, um, oh, what's the word? You know, when you colonize, that word, when you live in a place. Oh, colonize, that's the word. All right, Kothlis. Oh, there's the Snape in the Endor. Severus Snape. <laughs> Having a good time. What we're going to do while we're here is we're going to start building some new fleets. And it's not so much building new fleets. Okay, these are going to be the transports. We're going to reorganize things into at least two fleets. Lando's Dong. I thought that got destroyed. No, I want Lando's Dong to be its own fleet. There we go. These will be Corvettes. This is a little bit of boring minutia, but this is the perfect time for us to do it, as we're waiting for, um, what are we waiting for? The frigates to show up. So we'll put the corvettes in there. Man, we got a lot of gunships. Oh yeah, that's because we merged like three or four fleets to form this. All right, that looks like it's all the Corvettes. The Katana, we will start a new fleet with you. We're going to we're going to change all these fleets momentarily. Uh, this these will be carriers. I'll uh, put the Narwhal in there, number 7. Some have proper names, some don't. Man, a lot of these And then let's create one more fleet, which will be frigates for Friggin' and the Reagan.
Oh man, how am I going to do that? I'm going to take all of these. Oh shit, more messages. We'll get onto those in a moment. We'll put those on the frigate's fleet. Okay, so that's pretty good. Let's see. Diplomacy mission, it failed. Mine deployed to Corita. Training facilities idle. Ooh, that's good news. In seven days, we'll be able to try and take Marist. So let us create... We will rename this to... Uh, Fleet 6. Transports. How many fleets do I want to make? Well, let's see how many carriers we have. Two, four, six. Uh, we have enough ships here to make three fleets, I believe. So the first fleet's going to remain the biggest fleet. The sixth fleet, we're going to rename these better later on. Will be the second fleet. And then... Transports, you are going to be... We'll rename them the third fleet. So much micromanagement. Okay, so these are going to be the three major fleets. This is going to be the first fleet. We're going to keep the Caesarea in it because it's been in there forever. The bulk transport um, because we want troops on there. We'll probably build some more. In fact, we'll build some How more right I now. Send them right there. Certainly. The Mon Calamari Cruiser. We will put one of the frigates into the second fleet. We want another frigate for the third fleet. Let's see if we can build one quickly. No, that'll take forever. Well, we'll get one from uh, elsewhere. So Lando's Dong has to go back to the first fleet. That's just how it goes. And other than that, we're just going to kind of randomly put these out evenly between all the fleets. Probably going to have plenty of gunships. It doesn't matter if they're exactly even. Alright, so let's do the same thing with the carriers. The Katana and Narwhal will go in the first fleet. These will go on the second fleet. These will go on the third fleet. First fleet. And the second fleet. And then when it comes to frigates, the Michigan and the Utini have to go to the first fleet. As will the Oliver Twist. Uh, these will go to the second fleet. These two will go to the third fleet. Um, Hans Boster will go to the first fleet. Second fleet. Third fleet. Alright, who got their Charmoth? What the hell is Charmoth? Oh, I know where Charmoth is. Charmoth is the one we recently took over. Wedge and Adar headed over there. In fact, Wedge, I want you to be the new admiral. No, you're going to be the commander. So he's going to take all the fighters out. He'll be in charge of the fighters. Now we got an admiral and a general. We've got good leaders out here. I'm going to actually build some more troops here, I too. Because we might have to send this fleet out into space before too long. It can carry a ton of dudes. Certainly. So they might have to go out there and do uh, colonize missions. So let's get back to Coruscant. We have three fleets now. Oh, the 19th fleet arrived somewhere. All right, we're going to deal with that too. So the 19th fleet here is at Sedri. We're going to drop some Celestrians off. That's your new home. They're going to be like, this ball of planet is cold. How can I assist you? Yep, you live on Planet Balls now. We'll send some mines there so you can work in the mines. <laughs> like, why did I get a job for the em or the uh, not the Empire, the Republic? For the rebels, I should say, technically. All right, so the first fleet. We have a frigate on the way. It is maxed out with fighters. Who is on it? Okay, the first fleet is missing the right personnel. First fleet needs everybody. Luke, you will be in charge of the fighters. Solo, you'll be the admiral. And... Bren, you can be the general. And we're going to move the first fleet because you can see they're damaged. We're going to move them to Uvina because we have shipyards on Uvina where they can repair the ships. The second fleet is going to be renamed... What is it? Uh... 
Capital Defense Fleet. Can I fit all that in there? That's too much. Cap Def Fleet. That's our Capital Defense Fleet. They are not going to leave Coruscant. That is their job to defend Coruscant from anybody who will attack. They're going to get a frigate here. Uh, they're going to be able to add a couple more fighters. And then the third fleet... Can we send can some more you? troops to them? That's too far away. I believe Coruscant can build troops. No, they can't. You know what? I do want to build on Coruscant, though. We want to build an LNR series. Oh, that's going to take forever. Certainly. Uh, units arrive at Coruscant. Good, good, good. And the shipyard here is... In oh, you know what else we're going to do? Why don't we send all these fighters? Look at all these fighters we got. Oops, I hit the wrong button. These guys are all going to Coruscant. We're going to have a massive ship redeployment of fighters to Coruscant. I don't... I didn't... I don't think there's any way the Empire will ever... Reach Ever retake that. Hopefully that's not pride going before the fall. But next episode I'm going to be like, Well guys, remember when we used to have Coruscant? But there are so many fighters we were sending there. The Empire would have a very hard time between that and the home defense fleet to take it. I do have to, because I'm anal about it, rename the second fleet. Oh, do I? No. I have to rename the third fleet. We will rename that the 5th Fleet, because apparently we don't have a 5th Fleet currently. You are the 5th Fleet? I want to get some more dudes on there. Well, we really don't want to take them from Coruscant. Because what I really want to do is get the 3rd Fleet to begin to explore, or the 5th Fleet, to begin to explore the Outer Rim in case they're out here somewhere. In fact, we're going to do that. We're going to send them to the Modal system. So that we can start exploring out here and see what the heck is going on. Because... The last thing we we only need one more thing to win. We only need to capture the Emperor. I have found a new Jedi. Right, we know Chewie has the force. He failed at Charmath. The Chewie Emperor, I love that delicious treat. Mmm, <laughs> so delicious and angry in my mouth. <laughs> yeah, that sounds wrong. Alright, the first fleet will be at Yuvina in two days. As soon as that is healed, and as soon as they get their frigate ready, and I'm not sure when they're going to get it. Then I want to move towards Belmora. Training facilities idle. Let's see, Kothless, we don't have any more boat cruisers. What about Freitas? No. Ooh! Diplomacy mission by Beardo McGee there. Kind of reminds me of the president from the Federation in the last Star Trek film. I mean, Star Trek VI, the last of the original crew. Oh look, this is starting to like us. They're not pissed off at us anymore. <laughs> Ew. Alright, units arrive at Uvina. That's the oh wait. Oh, I think they arrived on our ship, yeah. Oh wait, no, these guys are here. Cool. We're gonna move these guys to Coruscant. Jan Dodon is gonna be in for a big surprise when he shows up. That we finally took Coruscant. And we have the first fleet here trying to repair the Caseria and the Michigan. And then hopefully we can go attack these ships here. Ooh, go Lando! Lando is so fucking smooth. He got Coruscant. I'm sorry, I got too excited. I got too loud there. Coruscant, the head of the Empire... We just took him over, and he already got them to like us a little bit. He's like, hey, baby, don't you want to be cool? It's like, oh, my God, Billy D. Williams, you're so cool. The Mon Calamari crews, there are three, has been deployed at War Tendo. Oh, yeah, I forgot we were building a new fleet at War Tendo. Let's build a couple Nebulon B frigates. Uh, 
Not bad at all. And hopefully I didn't miss any of these little guys out here. Yeah, he's on his way to Fef. How about Mrist? Is Mrist ready? Yes, we have all six of our guys here. These are the two rebel, or I'm sorry, Imperial planets we know of that are left. Mrist and Bel Belmar. Still think there's probably some, and it might be a big pain in the ass searching the outer room to try and find them. All we need to do is capture Lord Vader. So we're going to assault Mrist. Lord Vader was unfortunately not here. We did capture this guy. Or he was already on a ship. I don't know. One or the other. Do we have any diplomats around here, come to think of it? Um, no. None of these guys are good at diplomacy. In fact, Snub is a six. He's that bad. He's like, what, you like the six? I six you real good. No, that's not what I meant. Well, on the plus side, we do have Mrist. Where are the nearest diplomats? General, you're not. Maybe if we get lucky, Leia Organa can get one out. And by that, I mean recruit one. Palin captured. Oh, we did capture him. All right. I bet he was trying to leave, and we captured him via the Navy. Where is he? Captain Jalad Paleon is a competent, if somewhat cautious, battle commander. Good. More. Well, man, he had good diplomacy. So he must have been the guy who got Mrist to like them more. Because they used to like us some. Alright, Delea is done building things. Oh, okay, there is a Corellian Corvette. Not Corellian. Uh, Gravity Well Frigate on its way to the defense fleet. I think the other one is building, being built in Commodore. That one's almost done. Uh, Delea, why don't we have you build one for the second fleet? Once we get these in all of our fleets, if we run into any Imperial ships, as long as we outnumber them, the Empire is screwed. Feth. Alright. Celestin Regiment, hope you like living there. Oh no, that's not why I signed up! Have fun sexing each other in the butts. You didn't leave us any ladies! How can I assist you? Well, I'll get you some minor ladies, I guess. That's illegal! No, I mean the ones that work in the mines, you dweebs. Perverts. We go build a mine for Feth. That was weird all around. I had nothing to do with it. I blame everyone but me. Celestian Regiment deployed. Lusty Regiment deployed to Coruscant. You can see I'm trying to get as many troops here as we can to make it difficult for them like they made it difficult for us. How can I assist you? Uh, can we build some gen cores? Certainly. Excellent. How much longer until the Michigan is finished? Oh, the shield recharge rate is way down. It must have got seriously damaged uh, in the bombardments. I failed to do anything at Snab with American life insurance. I don't remember what it is, diabetes. Sorry, Winville for Bremley. A frigate has been deployed at Charmoth. So sweet, we have our first Gravity Well frigate deployed. Unfortunately, it's not with the first fleet like I want it to be, but... We need to keep this up. Oh, sweet. Yeah, I'll keep it up all night long for you, girl. Princess Get Laid a Lot has uh, um, recruited Garm. I hope you know what you're doing. I don't know. Bella Ibis. He is not very good at diplomacy. And Vigo is zero. I guess we're going to leave these guys both on coastal list just to try and defend our capital. The other thing we could do if we really wanted to would be to move our capital to Coruscant. That'd be putting all of our eggs in one basket, though. I think that would probably be a bad idea. It'd be an exciting idea. Ah. So that dweeb 
arrived at Coruscant. He can't command anything. He's just going to be a part of the defense fleet. We actually need to build a transport for this. How can I assist you? Certainly. Ooh, fleet arrives at Valrar. Rar. Where are we? Right here. Boop. And we will build another mine How for them. How can I assist you? That's not a mine. Certainly. Man, I want Belmora so bad. The big thing is... Is Commodore done yet? Commodore is finished. Excellent. While you're at it, Commodore, it's time for you to build you guys another fleet for yourself. And we're going to build some troops here if we can. I want some Y-Wing recon teams. Oops, I want 10. So that if need be, we can start Certainly. trying to find a quicker way to look through the outer li limb. The outer limb? It's like your hands or your arms, the outer rim. What's hard like a de dick? Well, man, I totally lost track of time. I didn't realize, like, my time is up already. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. It was a little bit more, um... Well, we took Mris. I was going to say it's a little bit more bookkeeping episode, but we took Mris, so there's only one planet we know of that the Empire has which is a Belmora. And in 11 days, our Gravity Well frigate will arrive with the first fleet, and we might at that point, even if the Michigan is damaged, we might take the Lando's Dong and everything, take Commander Skywalker, Admiral Solo, and the crew, and we might go after Belmora to try and destroy the Imperial fleet. I hope to see you all then. Wait, what's this? Oh, just diplomacy. Oh, and Mon Mothma. Has us. Uh, I didn't want to end and fail. Thanks, Mon Mothma. I'll see y'all next time.